Hello everyone, and welcome back to the channel. In recent events, a video has surfaced from Nigeria that sheds new light on Meghan Markle's experiences and her expressions of frustration regarding the treatment she has received as a black woman. The footage captures a candid moment where she addresses the complexities of her identity and the challenges associated with it. This new evidence has sparked conversations worldwide, igniting discussions about race, privilege, and the intersection of these dynamics within the royal family. As we delve into this narrative, it is essential to explore not only the content of the video, but also the broader implications it holds for society. Meghan Markle, known for her roles as an actress and a member of the British royal family, has faced significant scrutiny since her marriage to Prince Harry. Critics have often highlighted her mixed-race heritage and how it has influenced public perception. This video from Nigeria adds a new layer to the narrative, showcasing her emotional response to the pressures she has encountered. The context of the video reveals a moment of vulnerability, where Meghan expresses her feelings about being treated differently due to her race, despite her status and achievements. The emotional weight of her words resonates deeply, especially in a global context where discussions about race are increasingly prominent. Meghan's frustration is not just personal. It reflects a broader societal issue that many individuals of color face every day. The video serves as a reminder that even those who appear to have it all can struggle with their identities and the prejudices that come with them. This intersection of race and royalty is particularly poignant, as it challenges the traditional narratives associated with the British monarchy. As we analyze the content of the video, it becomes evident that Meghan's lashing out is not merely an expression of anger but an articulation of pain and a cry for understanding. She challenges viewers to reconsider their perceptions of race and how it interplays with status. Her words serve as a call to action, encouraging people to reflect on their biases and the systemic inequalities that persist in society. This moment is significant, as it brings to light the often overlooked experiences of black women in positions of power and influence. The Nigerian audience's response to the video has also been noteworthy. Many have expressed solidarity with Megan, sharing their own experiences of racism and identity struggles. This connection illustrates a shared understanding that transcends geographical boundaries. The dialogue sparked by this video is crucial as it fosters a sense of community among those who feel marginalized. It emphasizes the importance of listening to and amplifying the voices of those who are often silenced or dismissed. In the wake of this revelation, the media's portrayal of Meghan Markle has come under scrutiny once again. Critics argue that the coverage has often been racially charged, perpetuating stereotypes and biases that reflect a broader societal issue. This video serves as a counter-narrative, challenging the skewed perceptions that have dominated headlines. It encourages viewers to reconsider their own beliefs and the narratives they consume, highlighting the need for more nuanced and empathetic portrayals of individuals from diverse backgrounds. Moreover, Megan's experience is a powerful reminder of the importance of representation. As a biracial woman within the royal family, she has had to navigate a complex landscape of expectations and assumptions. The video captures a moment where she breaks free from those constraints, allowing her authentic self to shine through. This authenticity is crucial as it fosters a deeper connection with audiences who may have felt alienated by traditional narratives. As we explore the implications of this video further, it is essential to consider the role of social media in shaping public discourse. Platforms like YouTube have become powerful tools for individuals to share their stories and experiences. Megan's candidness has sparked conversations that resonate with many, allowing others to share their own narratives of struggle and resilience. This digital age has given rise to a new wave of activism, where personal stories can inspire collective movements for change. The dialogue surrounding Meghan Markle's experiences is not just about one individual. It encapsulates a larger conversation about race, identity, and systemic inequality. As the world grapples with these issues, it is crucial to recognize the power of storytelling and fostering empathy and understanding. Megan's video serves as a poignant reminder that everyone's experiences are valid and deserve to be heard. It is through these shared narratives that we can begin to dismantle the biases that persist in our societies. As we continue to unpack the nuances of this story, it is essential to approach the topic with sensitivity and respect. Megan's journey is uniquely hers, 
marked by triumphs and challenges that many can relate to. The video provides a glimpse into her reality, inviting viewers to engage with her narrative on a deeper level. This engagement is vital, as it promotes a culture of understanding and solidarity among individuals from different backgrounds. In conclusion, the new evidence from Nigeria adds a significant dimension to the ongoing conversation surrounding Meghan Markle's experiences as a black woman. Her emotional response serves as a catalyst for discussions about race, privilege, and identity. As we navigate this complex landscape, it is crucial to listen to and amplify the voices of those who have been marginalized. The power of storytelling cannot be underestimated, and it is through these shared narratives that we can foster a more inclusive and empathetic society. The reaction from the Nigerian audience following the release of Meghan Markle's video has been a powerful testament to the shared experiences of individuals grappling with race and identity across different cultures. In the wake of the video, social media platforms erupted with discussions, hashtags, and personal stories, creating a vibrant tapestry of voices that echoed Meghan's sentiments. Many Nigerians felt a deep connection to her narrative as it resonated with their own struggles against systemic racism and cultural biases. For many Nigerians, Megan's expressions of frustration struck a chord, as they recognized the universal nature of her experience. The conversations that unfolded online were not limited to discussions about Megan alone. They evolved into broader dialogues surrounding the struggles faced by individuals of African descent globally. This sentiment was particularly poignant in Nigeria a country rich in cultural diversity but also grappling with its own issues of colorism and tribalism. Many viewers took to platforms like Twitter and Instagram to share their own stories of feeling marginalized or judged based on their skin color, heritage, or accents. The Nigerian audience's response showcased a sense of solidarity and communal understanding. Many individuals recounted personal experiences where they faced prejudice or bias, either in their own country or abroad. The shared pain of being judged for the color of one's skin was a unifying theme, allowing for a deeper connection with Megan's emotions. For instance, numerous users shared anecdotes about facing discrimination in professional settings or being stereotyped based on their appearance, mirroring the challenges that Megan articulated in her video. Moreover, the reaction from Nigeria highlighted the resilience and strength found within these shared experiences. Many individuals emphasized the importance of owning one's identity and advocating for representation in various spheres of life. The conversations surrounding Megan's video served as a platform for empowerment, urging individuals to embrace their unique backgrounds and challenge the stereotypes imposed upon them. The dialogue quickly shifted from merely discussing Megan's frustrations to celebrating the strength and beauty of Black identity across the globe. In the context of Nigerian culture, where storytelling plays a vital role in preserving history and fostering community, the video became a catalyst for sharing personal narratives. Many Nigerians began to recount their familial stories of resilience against colonialism, social injustices, and the ongoing fight for equality. This intergenerational sharing of experiences not only deepened the discourse, but also reinforced the idea that struggles with identity are not isolated events, but part of a larger narrative that transcends borders. As discussions progressed, the Nigerian audience also expressed their admiration for Megan's courage to speak out about her experiences. Her willingness to confront the challenges posed by her mixed-race heritage resonated deeply with many who have faced similar battles. This admiration morphed into a broader conversation about the importance of visibility and representation in media, politics, and entertainment. Many Nigerians called for more diverse portrayals of Black individuals in these spaces, arguing that authentic representation is crucial in dismantling stereotypes and fostering understanding. Furthermore, the video sparked discussions about the role of the media in shaping public perception. Nigerian viewers highlighted the stark contrast between Meghan's personal experiences and the often sensationalized portrayals of her in the British tabloids. This realization led to a critical examination of how narratives are constructed and disseminated, emphasizing the need for more responsible journalism that amplifies the voices of those affected by racism and prejudice. In the aftermath of the video's release, community forums and online discussions flourished, creating safe spaces for individuals to express their thoughts and feelings. Many found solace in knowing they were not alone in their struggles, 
and this collective catharsis fostered a sense of unity among people from various backgrounds. It served as a reminder that while experiences may differ, the underlying emotions of frustration, resilience, and hope are universal. In conclusion, the Nigerian audience's reaction to Meghan Markle's video transcended mere sympathy. It evolved into a powerful movement of shared experiences, solidarity, and empowerment. By connecting their stories to hers, many individuals found strength in their identities and the collective narrative of Black resilience. This moment not only highlighted the importance of representation, but also underscored the necessity of open dialogues about race, privilege, and identity, fostering a deeper understanding of the complexities that individuals face in their journeys. As the conversations continue to unfold, the impact of Megan's candidness will undoubtedly echo for years to come, inspiring others to share their stories and advocate